This story is created by a parent like you, using Tailbot. Marlowe Evergreen and the Enchanted Echoes of Mystical Meadow A special bedtime story for Marlowe Evergreen In the quaint village of Meadowbrook, where every cottage had a garden blooming with roses and daisies, lived a nine-year-old boy named Marlowe Evergreen. Marlowe was known for his curiosity and bold heart, always seeking adventures beyond the meadows and forests that cradled his home. One afternoon, as the sun painted the sky in shades of orange and pink, Marlowe stumbled upon a hidden path veiled by thickets and overhanging vines. A gentle whisper in the wind urged him forward, and with a heart full of excitement and a dash of bravery, Marlowe stepped into the unknown, into the heart of Mystical Meadow. The path twisted and turned, each bend unveiling wonders that Marlowe's eyes had never beheld. Trees with leaves of silver and gold, flowers that sang sweet melodies, and a brook with waters so clear, it reflected the dreams of those who peered into it. Marlowe was enchanted. As he ventured deeper into the meadow, he encountered a creature of such beauty and grace, it took his breath away, a unicorn named Airless. Airless, with her coat as white as snow and a mane that shimmered under the sun's last rays, approached Marlowe with a gaze full of wisdom. Airless, Marlowe ventured, his voice a mix of awe and curiosity. What brings such a magnificent creature like you to this meadow? Airless smiled, a sparkle in her eyes. This meadow is not just any place, Marlowe. It's where the heart of nature beats strongest, and its magic is the purest. But its magic is fading because the heartstone, the source of all magic in Mystical Meadow, has been stolen by a shadowy figure driven by greed. Marlowe's heart sank. The thought of such a beautiful place losing its magic was too much to bear. What can I do to help? he asked, determination setting his jaw. Airless nuzzled Marlowe gently. You, Marlowe Evergreen, possess the bravest heart and the purest intentions. Only you can retrieve the heartstone. Along your journey, you will encounter three trials that will test your courage, kindness, and wisdom. Overcome these, and you can restore the magic to Mystical Meadow. And so, Marlowe set off on the greatest adventure of his life, guided by Airless. Their journey took them to the edge of whispering woods, where shadows danced and whispered secrets. Marlowe's first trial awaited him here, a bridge guarded by a fearsome troll who demanded a treasure for passage. Remembering Airless's words about kindness, Marlowe offered the troll the most precious thing he had, a locket given to him by his mother. Moved by Marlowe's willingness to part with something so dear, the troll allowed them to pass, teaching Marlowe that kindness can turn foes into friends. Tailbot, tailor-made tales for your child's dreams. Next, they arrived at a vast desert of shifting sands and scorching sun, the trial of wisdom. Here, a sphinx posed a riddle, one that would require all of Marlowe's wit to solve. What comes once in a minute, twice in a moment, but never in a thousand years? Marlowe pondered, the grains of sand slipping through time. Then, it struck him. The letter M, he exclaimed. The sphinx smiled, and the path forward revealed itself, proving that wisdom often lies in seeing the simplicity in complexities. The final trial, the trial of courage, awaited in the gorge of fears, where one's deepest fears manifest. Marlowe faced his fear of darkness, walking through a cavern so dark, the concept of sight seemed a memory. With each step, his fear grew, but so did his resolve. By believing in his own light, Marlowe conquered the darkness, emerging into the light of day, stronger and braver than ever. At last, they reached the lair of the shadowy figure, a sorcerer who had stolen the heartstone to craft a world in his image, a world devoid of wonder and magic. The sorcerer, seeing the determination in Marlowe's eyes, unleashed his darkest spells. But Marlowe, with the lessons of kindness, wisdom, and courage etched in his heart, deflected the spells, reaching the heartstone. With a touch filled with love for Mystical Meadow, Marlowe restored its magic, banishing the sorcerer and his dark vision. Marlowe and Airless returned to Mystical Meadow as heroes, the heartstone's magic cascading through the land, 
reviving its beauty and wonder. The meadow's creatures gathered, singing songs of gratitude and joy for Marlow, the boy who saved their home. As the stars began to twinkle in the night sky, Marlow realized it was time to return home. Airless nuzzled him one last time. Remember, Marlow, the greatest adventures lie not in the lands you journey to, but in the heart you journey with. Marlow walked back to Meadowbrook, his heart full of memories, adventures, and a newfound understanding that bravery, kindness, and wisdom are the most powerful magics of all. He fell asleep that night, dreaming of magical meadows and mystical pathways, knowing in his heart that he would always carry a piece of mystical meadow with him. And in the village of Meadowbrook, the flowers bloomed a little brighter, the birds sang a little sweeter, for in their midst lived Marlow Evergreen, the boy who brought magic back to the mystical meadow. Created by a kid and their parents using Tailbot, click the link in the video description to create your own story.